Hey everybody, it's me, and me. Oh, welcome back to more Pikmin 2 Challenge Mode! In the last episode, we got through the Twilight Garden, which was a very scary experience. In this episode, we are heading to the Cryptic Cavern, which is also probably going to be a very scary experience, because we only have five Steves and five Lennies for a five-floor dungeon? Well, at least we got a lot of potions, but why do I have the feeling this is going to be very scary? Because we're getting further in the difficulty as we go through these. So, of course, it's going to be more difficult. Let's go. Any candy pop buds here to save the day? Let's find out. Oh, boy. How lonely it is. Nobody laugh at my jokes. All right, whatever. Let's see what we got here. Can I move the cursor? Thank you. Nothing. There's a boss. There's a boss of some kind. Oh, Doodlebug. Okay. The Doodlebug boss. How scary. Uh, let's see. Let's go ahead and get this guy. I did it. Okay. What's the catch? That can't be it for the first one. Maybe there's be nice. I guess we could have potentially lost some to poison. That was a possibility? What else is in here? You can't fool me, Nintendo. I'm no rookie. Okay, what? No. You're just tripping. <laughs> okay. I like how he stumbled over his foot and then flew forward. That's his idea of tripping. Okay, whatever. There's nothing here. Okay, let's save time, I guess. Then go in the hole. Get in there. Hoo! Hoo! Whip, whip. Number two. Let's see what we got. Thankfully, I have all the potions, so it was good. I was expecting to use one potion per floor, but that's not the case. Oh, uh, what do we got? We have... Huh. Just... Is that it? Is this seriously it? Just like one enemy per floor? And it's always the same layout? I don't need no potion for this. I'm no wuss. I don't need any sort of stinking potion for a watery blowhog. I am losing all my flowers, though, which is kind of unfortunate, but who cares? Easy peasy. Okay, whatever. Just doing this again. Latch onto that. And we have just the perfect amount to get this. I don't see what the problem is. It's probably going to be more and more worse, I know. But so far, we're good. I probably shouldn't be saying this because I'm just, like, begging. I'm literally begging the... Jinx Masters, or the Jinx Gods, whatever you want to call them, to, like, just completely destroy me in the next few floors. But so far, just perfectly fine. Just one enemy in these tiny little rooms? I, I'm okay with that. Let's see what's up next. Hoo, hoo. I don't know. Gotta mix it up sometimes. It is very cryptic, I'll give it that. Like, I'm just too bewildered to even come up with a conversation topic. So I'm just like, what the fruit is even going on? Who's number three? Challenge number three is... Okay, that that's a bit... That's a bit... Uh, uh just gotta, like, be patient, though. We should be fine! So I have three Pikmin. That's unfortunate. I said I was going to hashtag reset. It's still possible for me to finish the dungeon. I have like, I have the two different types. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. I could have used the sneak and bitter spray to stop him from doing that, but I was like, nah, I can whistle. Whistles are great. It's also great in Pikmin 2 or Pikmin 3 where electricity doesn't kill you in one hit. You just get a little zappity zap. Oh, I knew I was asking for it, but I... Let's see if I can finish this with three Pikmin then. Oh boy. Number four. Let's see, what do we got? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, Steve is the only one who could even hit that thing, so... I guess just attack it.
I could sacrifice a... No, no, no. Do not do not eat him, please. I could sacrifice a... A, a Lenny. I kind of want to sacrifice a Lenny. Because we've already gone this far. Why the fruit not? Because, like, you can't even... You can't even do that. So, like... Just, just eat it. Just eat it. Just eat it. I'm fine with that. Oh, it did not do as much damage as I thought it was going to do. That's unfortunate. Okay, let's put him back to sleep. Uh, can you... Ugh. Jerk. Go away. This is fine. This is fine! We'll, we'll take care of whatever's on the last floor with one red potion by the end of this. No problem, I'm sure. Okay. Let's... Do this. Do this. See how much damage we could do. Oh boy. This is... This is gonna be fun. Just gonna like, keep on throwing him on there. Okay, this is like... Doable? Probably should have done this like with the first potion so I could have gotten as much out of the juice as possible. Just keep on attacking. It's somewhat working. If I lose the Steve, it's all over though. Oh boy, oh boy. Attack all the more and Louis, attack with all you can! Even though we don't have the super punch ability. Come on. We might be able to salvage it. Olimar's down. Well, you get to see what a Pikmin, what Captain Dine is like. Just flies on up, and he's out of here. Did that ever happen in the original? Oh, you can't even lose a single captain. Okay, that's unfortunate. Well, that's lame. All right, let's try this again. I'll meet you back on the third floor, I guess, because that's where everything changed when the Lightning Nation attacked. You know what, because I'm still incredibly stingy with my items, and because I don't know how to learn my stinking lesson, well, let's just go into this with Olimar and Louie, and see if they can take it out on their own. I know we don't have the charge punch, but they don't have a lot of HP, so yeah. This was definitely the right decision. Just don't get zapped like that, but yeah. Okay, get away, get away, get away! Ugh, okay, maybe it wasn't the right decision, because we can't lose a single captain, as we've learned. But that was a lot better than last time, I'll say that much. Okay, it was a worthy sacrifice. Uh, sure. Come on. Louie, Lenny, whatever your name is. Fine! Just do that then. Get up over here and we are good. Okay, so now that I got the whole game here with me, we hopefully will be fine for the Fiery Bull Blacks. Uh, oh, it's right here, the ship. Right over here. I mean, I haven't even seen what the fifth floor contains. I feel like it's going to be a boss or something. <laughs> Cryptic Cavern. Got that nice little Steve butt right there. Oh, boy. Let's separate. Just get Steve. I could beat him with five Steves right now. Let's freeze. And potion. I did that in the wrong order. Hurry up and kill him, please. And... We're good. We're not good. I hate you. Oi. So stinking close. Whatever. Uh, we don't have enough to carry him now because sadness. So we can't get the perfect score. Oh well. So we can go on the next floor. And with nine Pikmin, let's see if that is detrimental to our plan of success. more arena, and the final boss is going to be... A final floor. No, it's going to be... Oh, it's a boss of some kind. Who is it? Okay. I was not expecting that. Okay. Okay. I got I got you. I got your number. Let's... Do that. And swarm... Why aren't you swarming? Ugh. Remember which one it is. 
okay. Should be fine, should be fine. Oh, it didn't even latch on. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Okay, good. Let's go back underground. Okay. Let's deal. This is fine, this is fine. Throwing Snagrid is not difficult. Just gotta be patient. I can also just sacrifice Lenny if I want to, but I don't want to. It's a really good lock onto the head right there. Uh, let's see. Okay. Just throw, 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 throw. And we should be good to go. He's got no HP, but he went back underground. It'd be really awkward if like, he glitched into having no help. Or like just died underground. We couldn't get the key. Pop, 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 pop. And he's just ahead. In Pikmin 3, he uh, leaves his entire body behind, which is even more creepy when you just drag it along. I don't know what's weirder like, or more terrifying. A disembodied head or a stinking... Like, how did this get... Like, this was rated E for everyone. What the fruit? <laughs> I'm surprised Pikmin 2... Uh, Pikmin 3 Deluxe isn't rated T. It's like, it just outright says, like, you kill the monsters and everything. And, like, you carry their corpses back and, like, feed off the... I don't know. It just... Uh, it just threw the happy pappy Nintendo filter. So it just magically makes it okay. But okay, we only lost one Pikmin. His sacrifice will not be forgotten. Maybe. Okay. Just go ahead and power up all these guys and get this thing open as quickly as possible. Gotta get that delicious time bonus. It'll make all the difference. Maybe. Possibly. Come on. Hurry up. What the fruit? Why does this take so long? I know there's only nine Pikmin, but still. You're powered up. Thank you. Okay. Exit the level. I missed it. Uh, can we get better than our first score? Uh, n wait, yes, okay, we did, ever so slightly. There we go. And that is it for challenge mode, for today anyway. Next time on Pikmin 2 challenge mode, we are headed into the Concrete Maze. Oh, that Pikmin count. Oh boy, this is Midnight and Beyond, and I will see you all later. Good night.